But CMR no some can't call my phone. CMR cannot call my phone because the first first thing listen, me not block him but him just cannot call me. And if he do call me, me just not go for answer. Him know why I'm doing conscience most about him. Him know why I'm be my big man. In my big man, me just I start like me, me not really know nothing about you know me not, me not grow up on the street like that. You understand? But him know what I'm do and him know him, him know. In a film, he him know what I'm do. You understand? So me not even come here to so come explain like, nothing to nobody. Because him can't call my phone. Because if him call me, me not go answer. Because why more call me and say you really go live and tell people? You really go live and tell people from about last year. And that more call me and say why why could I possibly have to say to me? Her wife with her. Yeah, man, me people and she kind of did that um give give the people them hints because everybody did say a cmr she finally came out and ticked that last night and basically called cmr name and say yo cmr is the youtuber who basically she have sex with and that the you and that the youtuber basically cheated on his wife yeah man my people and me she say you know the girl wanna sit on the screen so you understand so she say yo she exposed him on um tiktok last night and she say yo how can he be a married man and basically came to her for SEX? You understand? Because you know say, when it comes to a relationship and marriage, if you're not happy, it makes sense to leave. It not makes sense. You basically a cheat upon your partner. You understand, my people? So I guess that go on and basically she has say, CMR slept with her. Meanwhile, she was in um, a whole relationship, a whole marriage with Chrissy. You understand my people? So basically when him did that talk about the CMR must call her and I say yo, you don't know say yo if she basically expose anything about him, him basically I gotta do something to her. Where she not gonna lie. And they know in a them times like these you know my people, anytime a man has seen a woman chat, you know, not take it lightly. You understand my people? So she has say yo if anything happened to her or her family or no know a who do it you understand at the end of the day as me say them people and me she say you know she say so she, she call cmr name brawling and you know say cmr is a youtube blogger you understand and them even have them other channel the carter family which is um cmr and his wife you understand and the family so them have a them have couple vlogs channel and cmr have him own channel because everybody know him as cmr before the whole Carter family black came me. So as I say, the girl speak up my people and she call CMR name and she say yo oh, CMR basically I try to basically take her three points, you understand? Be a chatty youth I sent to her. People watch the full live, share the video to her friend, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Uh, CMR no some can't call my phone. CMR cannot call my phone because the first first thing listen. I not block him, but he just cannot call me. And if he do call me, I just not go for answer. He know why I'm doing conscience most about him. He know why I'm be my big man. He my big man. I just start like, I don't really know nothing about You know, I don't, don't grow up on the street like that. You understand? But him know what I'm do and him know him, him know. In a film edit I'm do you understand? So I don't even come here to come explain nothing to nobody. Cause him can't call my phone. Cause if him call me, me not go answer. Cause why more call me and say, you really go live and tell people you really go live and tell people my business like and that him more call me and say, why why could I possibly have to say it to me? Why could a possibly have to say to me like and why would I want to hear why I'm to say like this nigga don't help to fuck me up more mental like me they been have mental issues and he make it worse so at this time like listen me, me, um really and truly let me tell you guys something I have depression, right? I've been traveling with depression for a while. For years, I have depression. I'm a victim of rape. I get rape already. Friends set me up. I have PTSD. I have all of that. All of the mental illness, I have them. 
I have anxiety. My anxiety depends on 100. Very, very high. So, like, me trusting this man. Me trust this man. Come here and say, oh, I don't think he would do stuff to me. Like, this nigga knew everything when I go through. Me literally stung and tell him, I've been abused. I've been raped. I lost my two babies. Like, I literally lost two babies. Two girls. And, like... I have really bad depression because them something that bother me, you understand? But like, what him do to me, it make it worse because like, I literally thought I trusted him. I literally think I did trust him. I did think I trust him, but I really didn't. Like, it was just my subconscious mind, you know? It was really my subconscious mind. You can't trust people. I've been a hear this. All my ex-boyfriend, my ex-boyfriend tell me you can't trust people, bro. I left my relationship with him. I move on. I mean, I'm still idiot. Like, I'm still stupid to certain things. I'm still soft to certain things. Because from my ex-boyfriend experience, I should have wise up and say, oh, no man can do this or that to me again. And it, it's the same thing when it's just wicked. Could actually be saving another girl from going through the same shit. Cause I'm sure not the only girl he did that. I'm not the only girl he did that to. But I'm the only girl that's brave enough to come. Cause like, probably if I didn't come out and talk about what happened, maybe he would do it to another person and they would be scared because, oh, he's a soldier, he's an ex-soldier, he's a this, he's a that. Like, so you thought I should be scared of you because you was a soldier, and you would you why would that do to me? Because if something do me right now, I have something for nobody for me. Everybody go and see yeah, you. Come on, don't come and tell everybody say you treat me, you know. And the little threat where you, where you said to me over the phone, I don't take it lightly. I really never take it lightly. So if you feel like you're slick, like you go and hurt me or whatever, it really don't make no sense at this point. It really don't make no sense. Yeah, but um. Yeah, uh, I don't really give a fuck who's watching. Like, I really honestly don't care. Come and never look nobody, man. A people, man, look me. You understand? I'm never tell nobody, man, say, I want to fuck them. A people, man, like me and fuck me. And so at this point, in all aspects, he's the one to be blamed. Because him knows I'm married, that him reach out to me, and him text me. First of all, you're married, you shouldn't even have any intention to text the next girl. And then have any like, intention to actually have intercourse with the next girl. So at this point, just give it up. I win. You lose. Ha 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 ha. Like, <laughs> yeah, man, my peeps, as me say, you hear where um, the girl have say, as me say, she goes by the name of Shani. And if you are um, on TikTok, you know, would have seen her live from last week. Me, yeah, she basically has a certain um, things on the live, but basically, I give people hints which could have led to a CMR. People pick up you already, some people never pick up you, but she literally call his name. As me say, my people, when it comes to relationship. When it comes to when you're well known and things like this, you understand? You can't do them things on my G. You understand? I don't say yo, I lie she are telling her because it would, I, I can't hype she look out for them. You understand? So, as, at the end of the day, still, they must know where they want. You, know? you understand? You're in a marriage, you're in a relationship with a person. You know, make sense to go out there and go basically cheat with the next girl. You understand? Because your whole reputation is going to look bad and. And every female is basically you go hold it and no one talk. It works if you are going like you want to rush, rush them and want to take them three pints or even want to trouble them family. I'm not going to take that, they going to put it out there in the clear, you understand? So she has say yo, the youth know the amount of hurt where she got through and she and the youth still did that, you understand? She said she was young and she was naive, you understand? She never was a street girl like that. 
But at the end of the day, still my people, them know where they want to the life, so they do it, you understand? Anyway, you still make me and a toss down below. And if you are new, subscribe to the channel, share the video to a friend. Yeah, man, more on this go viral. We go put yourself.